We share Aotearoa with some pretty special native wildlife. For millions of years, their only predators were birds, and our only mammals were a couple of bats. But when early settlers introduced animals like rats, possums and stoats, they put our native species at risk. While in the rest of the world, birds had evolved to protect themselves from mammals, our birds were used to eagles and harriers, predators in the sky with keen eyes. So they had evolved to stick close to the ground and freeze to avoid being seen. This doesn't work when your enemy is also on the ground. So New Zealanders made a choice to start protecting our native taonga from invasive predators. Iwi, community groups, businesses and individuals are working together with government departments using traps to make our country safer for its native animals. In difficult to reach places where trapping isn't possible, 1080 is distributed. This biodegradable toxin is useful in New Zealand as it targets mammals, not our native species. It also breaks down quickly in the environment and doesn't leave a permanent residue in water, soil, plants or animals. We now have small, predator-free havens throughout the country, including offshore islands where our birds can thrive. But we can't stop now. Lots of our creatures still aren't safe from predators. We want to create a new New Zealand, a safe, predator-free sanctuary for our native birds and animals. By using the methods we already have and thinking of bigger, more ambitious ways to protect our species, we can make New Zealand a safe place for the animals who've called it home for millions of years. Join us in making New Zealand wildlife safe from introduced predators.